guess what? We're live! Hey, guess what? It's just the Scott Kid or a Palestine Sheila Reno. It is Thursday night, and from Madison, Wisconsin, we have the Brash Menagerie for your viewing and listening enjoyment. Take my guess. Wow. Hi, we're the Brash Menagerie, and we're gonna yeah, we'll play some songs or whatever, I guess. This one's called All Out. One song in, after all. <laughs> all right, this one's called Optimistic Pessimist.
called canoe trip it goes out to my uh, buddies and we do a uh, well, we do a canoe trip every year for how long uh, let's see this is my like 15th year 16 something like that anyway I was like 10 when he started it <laughs> <laughs> all right young one young Padawan humble brag <laughs> yeah. oh, look at me I'm young I'm Drew all right here we go it's the third weekend in July, my own mother was mine So perhaps an army took my worst ship Because I'm going to get back and my father let me back It's not an easy look at the shit Good night out there. Yeah. It is a uh, rainy night out there. I can hear the crowd. You can hear the crowd. You can hear the you can hear the Facebook and YouTube crowd going wild. Oh, yeah. uh, all right. What's that? All right, shut my mouth. <laughs> all right. All right. So this next one is called the Sofa King. It's about my, uh, I had a roommate when I lived uh, on Oakland and Milwaukee who would play video games for rel roughly 16 hours a day. I think he worked for like four, played video games, and then slept for four. Yeah, whatever. Are you about ready? You start this one. Uh, well, all right. Also, there's nothing wrong with playing video games 16 hours a day. Just this is true. Game. This is true. I, I didn't, I wrote it. Long before we had a gamer in the group. <laughs> now it now it seems a little silly. <laughs> Thank you. 
I did just learn that. Now, now I am going to need one of those beers. Can we get one of those? Gotta stay oh, hydrated. Or hy- <laughs> I do gotta stay hydrated. Yeah, you call it right back. Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at that! Oh, oh man, oh. service was a good one. <laughs> you got it. All right, we got it. Yeah, maybe I don't know. <laughs> so a lot of the a lot of the songs I write or wrote. We're like about breakups and bad relationships and whatever, so I finally had to write one that was not about that. I guess, I don't know. Positive one. Hey, but yeah, a positive one. Uh, this one's called I Think You're Neat. Guitar player just joined a couple weeks ago. Yeah, yeah. still working the king so. Still, still working alone. Uh, are we really halfway through the set? How are we doing on time? You're doing good. <laughs> okay. This song's about parts. We're only 10 minutes in. 10 minutes in, here we go. Alright, this one, I don't get too political. I, I am political, but I don't like to write political songs mostly because I'm not good at them. That is, that, is that because that I'm not good joke. at writing any songs, or what was that about? I said, was that the joke? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so anyway, this one's, uh, this one's called Trump Eats Farts. Yeah, he's fine. But you got to the top with lies that just won't stop. 
So since we're not used to playing longer sets, we're going to take a little... I'm going to switch it up. I'm going to do an acoustic song about my neighbor that I hate. <laughs> yeah. Yay! guitar players like you, Drew. Whatever, man. Come back. Yeah. Come back. Alright. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. I'll take that guitar stand back. Alright. This one's, uh, this one's called Apartment Number 8. Because, uh, yeah. The uh, chick that used to live above me was absolutely horrible and I hated her guts. Number eight, because I really hated that chick that lived in apartment number eight. All right. And that stupid dog, Romeo. Romeo was the thing's name. Do another one. <laughs> no, get over here and bail me out. I'm done playing guitar. Yeah. 
train wreck. It's about a uh, uh, girl that I dated and she broke up with me for an unemployed heroin addict. <laughs> so yeah, oh yeah, she was a keeper. But well, I was not. Maybe I wasn't the keeper. Whatever. <laughs> We're gonna need HR now that there is a, a lady in the band. Uh, All right. <laughs> However, this one is about a girl named Natalie. Uh, Natalie does not like our band. She thinks we are the worst band she's ever heard. She's never heard two ball screwball then. <laughs> uh, no, she probably hasn't. She's she's kind of sheltered. Uh, but anyway, this one's called Natalie. It's a Sound. 
this one for a new EP that's coming out. We'll probably talk about it later, maybe. I don't know. We'll Actually, see. Actually, the next, the next three are. That's what he said. Oh, uh, don't, don't, don't spit that out. Gosh. Oh, oh boy. All right. Anyway. Cat's out of the bag. Cat is out of the bag. It was supposed to be a big surprise. The big reveal. All right. Here we go. This one's called I Hate This Song. Hey! 
one that wasn't a joke this really is our last one <laughs> oh man oh. there I go well, I guess I'll be moving on <laughs> all right that's the name of the day that's the name of the song yeah no nah, it was horrible yeah I don't don't yeah just start the damn song you know you found when the drummer was in
Stick around, I guess we'll be talking and stuff. Hey! I'm Jess the Scott Kid. Ooh, We're at Palisade oh. Sheila Reno. It's Thursday night. That was the Brash Menagerie, and after a short break, we're going to talk about all the new things with these guys. Okay, thanks. Bye! Come on in the 